Hello everyone and welcome to this video song for Antia video. Now I often get to thinking, wouldn't it be brilliant to get all the old software back? You know, certainly for today's kids, to be able to have the same excitement about computers as uh, I did, as well as my uh, colleagues over the colleagues and good friends on the internet, uh, Elmol3, uh, Matthew H16, and of course. Um, who can f if if you're gonna uh, be nostalgic over kids software, um, you have to at least see Billy Core, also known as Road Geek. But like I was saying, um, would it not be brilliant if you could have all of the titles for yesteryear back today? Well, last year, um, I did a. A review of uh, the iPad version of uh, Arthur's Teacher Troubles. Um, it's been uh, brought to the iPad uh, by a company called Wonderful, and um, it really was. Uh, it, it really actually is quite good. I mean, I I did say that these point-and-click uh, software titles and certainly Levin Books made sense on a touch screen. Well, today I have something else from you. Uh, for you from yesteryear. This time it was, but I don't know. Uh, I can't remember who brought it to the iPad, but it was um, Humongous, Enter Humongous Entertainment who originally gave life to uh, this program. This originally started life as a Windows point-and-click adventure uh, back in 1997, and it's called Putt Putt Saves the Zoo. So let's have a wee look. Okay, so I've run through this game once before, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit... Do you want to start all the way from the beginning? Yep, I do. I want to restart the game, and uh, we'll have a wee look at it. Looks like it's been brought to the um, iPad by Nimbus Games. Good morning, Mr. Baldini. Today's the opening of the Car Town Zoo. I know, but but it's a bigger day. How would you and a pepper like to take some zoo chow over there before they open? Would we ever, Mr. Baldini? <laughs> Wonderful. Here you go. Now you make sure that you give it to Outback Al, the new zookeeper. Don't worry. You can always count on me. Good luck, Bud Bud. So, uh, basically this, uh, just to tell you a wee bit of background about the story, um, this story is, uh, uh, what you have to do is, um, you go to visit Outback Al with the Zoo Chow, even, even though it sounds like he's saying Zoo Cha, but it's called Zoo Chow, that's, uh, basically food for the animals. You visit Outback Al only to find that, um, well, basically he's lost a load of animals, so you've got to actually explore the zoo, um, and you've got to, and along the way, um, while you're finding the animals, you've got to figure out um, certain puzzles, for example, there's one where you've got to try and uh, get uh, a bridge open across the river, um, there's one where you've got to dig the snow out, you've got to get a hot chocolate for uh, one of the snake, uh, a snakes who, uh, a snake who's uh, stuck in the uh, snow, and uh, basically things like that, so I'll, I'll just play through a wee bit of it, I'm not going to play the whole thing. Um, You've got to love that over, overly enthusiastic, um... Hello? Outback Al? It's me, Peppa. I'm here to deliver some zoo chow. 
Oh, how 90s. An intercom that barely works. Oh, and here's one of the many special... Wet 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 are a Scottish band, they're actually re they were actually really good, so yeah. Yeah, I, I kinda missed I kinda forgot about that. That's a that's a hidden feature if you uh, if you click on Oh hot ziggity dog ziggity boom what you do to me It's so new to me What you do to me Oh, way to do, way to Australian accent really good there, Outback Al. Pup, pup, what have I told you about volunteering whoever's playing a game for? We can't open the zoo until they're all rescued, so I'm counting on you, pup, pup. Here, this should help you out. It's a list of everyone who's missing. Baby Jumbo the elephant, Masai the giraffe, Kenya the lion cub, Zanzibar the hippopotamus, Sammy seal, and little Skeeter the snake. I'll find them for you. Good day and good luck, Putt Putt. Well, I'm off to fix up the place. See you later, Outback Al. So basically, like I said, I mean, it's... You, you've got to try and explore the zoo to try and get the animals back. Um, so let's see if I can rescue one the now. Um, hang on a minute. I've got a good idea, actually. Let's see. I might get a couple of uh, things from the souvenir cart. How about... Well, if it isn't Putt-Putt, it's going to be quite a day. I can't wait until the zoo opens. I'll have so many fine gift items to sell. Gorilla salt and pepper shakers, souvenir hubcaps, even free cameras. That's great, Patty. Well, feel free to have a look around. Thanks. Don't mind if I do. I have so many wonderful things for sale. Panda watches and giraffe pencils, duck back box, twinkle twinkle little star, and miniature plastic zoo tray. Oh my goodness. But, but just... I've obviously clicked the wrong thing. Just... Oh, camera, Patty. Take it, Pat Pat. The camera's a free one for customers. After all, it's opening day. Thanks, Patty. Right. I think it's this one that I wanted, not the other one. <laughs> Hi, Pat Pat. Hi, Chuck Wagon. Right. I'll have some cheese squiggly, please. Excellent choice. Here you go. And you don't have to pay me a thing. Oh, that's nice. I don't think that business model's gonna work I'll too well. Hot cocoa, please. Good choice, Pat Pat. I'll get it right away. Here you go, and it's on the house. Okay. Ooh, that's hot. I think I'll save it for later. 
So let's go and save an animal the now. Hang on, no, I can't. There's there's a few things that I have to do. It's uh, not as straightforward as you might think. So. So I mean. This looks pretty secure. Yeah. Whee! So that is one of the. Um, that is one of the obstacles you have to overcome. And you can you can basically just explore. I mean, there's there's uh, different possibilities. There's a toolbox in there. Yeah, I've played this before. You can probably tell. I'll bet Outback Al wouldn't mind a bit if I borrowed these. No, I'm I'm sure he wouldn't mind if you just kind of nicked his tools. He he's only a way trying to fix the place up and and yeah. So yeah yeah well. Oh, where is my baby? So basically, you can talk to the animals. Don't worry, I will find your little butt I wonder how I can get up that river. I sure can't swim. So, I mean, that's that's another thing you'd have to do is try and find a log. So, I mean, basically, there's, there's different bits that you need to save the different animals. So, I mean, the toolkit um, is there. You need... Um, You'll also need uh, something to save the uh, giraffe, the, the raft, and it's basically you've you've got all this to do. I'm just I, and I, mean, I could save the snake, but there's a slight problem with that. I'm pretty sure if. Oh wait a sneeze, pop pop. <laughs> Whoops a daisy. <laughs> oh my goodness. That avalanche almost got us. Now how are we gonna get through? Whoops. I think I know how. Hey, there's a rope inside. This could come in handy. I think I'll borrow it. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I know what, I can save one of the animals here. Watch this. You remember the cheese that I bought uh, from the uh, from the food kiosk? I can't go. There's a log in the road. Great. Now the road is clear and I... And the log is going to also come in handy as well. I'm not going to talk to the giraffe at the moment, I know. Wow! I can see all of the grassland. It's beautiful! I know. Oh my goodness, I'm not doing too well at this. Come on, back! Back you go, back you go. See if I can pass the giraffe. There's our way around. Oh yes, there is. I can, uh, there you go. Kenya, Kenya, where could you be? And you can also learn about the different animals as well. I want my mama. It's Baby Jumbo. Save me, save me. I'm under attack by a giant mouse. A giant mouse? <coughs> yeah, he jumped out and scared me. Can you save me? Please! I'll try! Move, Mousy, Mousy, Mousy! Go on, shoot! 
As fast as lightning, you say. Fetch, little mousy. I mean, giant scary mousy. <laughs> oh, thanks, Putt Putt. You're my hero. Oh, gosh, baby Jumbo. It was nothing. Now you better hurry home to your mama. Mama? Mama! Mama, maybe Jumbo's coming home. Aw, oh, yeah. And do you remember the tool cat from earlier? Five more animals to rescue before the zoo can open. You remember the tool cat from earlier? I think we're going to go and save, um... We can, uh, we can actually, uh, s there's a baby seal that we can actually save. And if we click here, we should find out all about elephants. In the wild, African elephants live on the continent of Africa. Really? The continent of Asia is where Asian elephants live. Elephants mostly eat grass, leaves, fruit, and twigs. Every day, elephants eat about 500 pounds of food. And each time they take a drink, they suck up to 40 gallons of water. Elephants are the heaviest land animals in the world, weighing up to 6,000 pounds. So basically, you can find out all about animals, so you've got an educational you aspect to the game. Be a way out of here. Hey! You must be Sammy Seal! What happened? I was having a great time splishing and splashing, and all of a sudden, the dam closed. Now I'm stuck. Maybe I can help. Oh, boy. I bet if we figure out a way to open the dam, you could swim home. Of course I could. I'm a super duper swimmer extraordinaire. Of course you are. So basically what we've got to do is we've got to try and match the shape of the dam. So if we click on the dam... I need to find something to help me lower the dam. I need to find something to help me lower the dam. So I think, um, I think that's a circle. So if I go back to the tool... If we got a to go back to the toolkit and we look for the circle... Oh. Nope. This one doesn't fit. Maybe we should try another one. Didn't realize it was that one, not that one. So, I think it's that one. That should fit. It fits! Get ready, Sammy. You're going swimming. Yeah! Oh. I still need to rescue four animals so the zoo can open. So basically, you get the idea. You've got to you've got to try and rescue all the animals um, to try and get them home. I missed you, Mama, and I missed you, Mud. So basically, that's that's what you've got to do. So. I do believe uh, this game cost me. I've I've had this game on the uh, on the iPad for um, quite a wee while now, and um, I believe it cost me about one ninety nine. And for that, I think it is definitely definitely worth it for the kids to play on point and click adventure. I mean, it's got fun. 
It's got songs, it's got puzzles, it's got education. You know, you've got the, the shape matching aspects, you've got uh, problem solving. And you also get to learn about the different types of zoo animals. And this is what the Putt-Putt games were always really quite good for. Is being able to wrap it all up in a nice, fun package. And there was a series of Putt-Putt games back in the 90s, which basically went, you know, these these were um, characters that, uh, you know, Putt-Putt and his wee dog Pep were, were two characters that you could really, you know, the kids could really get to know and, you know, become quite familiar and comfortable with. You know, with those two characters, you could actually... Uh, learn quite a lot by using the point and click uh, CD-ROM adventure titles. So would I recommend it for a child's iPad? Well, if um, if you're willing to risk an iPad, um, a, you know, into the hands of a child, which a lot of people actually do do, then yes, I would definitely, definitely, definitely recommend going and getting a copy of Pup Pup from the, uh, the App Store. Um... I would, um, you know, I, th I think the game is absolutely brilliant. And um, certainly um, certainly the uh, Topiary uh, song, that, that was also a nice wee hidden added bonus, if you can find it. So, um, yeah, I, uh, that, will, uh, that actually concludes this review of uh, Putt Putt Saves the Zoo. I'm a poet and I didn't even know it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy this video, please feel free uh, to subscribe. Um, and if you like my channel and want to find out more about it, please uh, also like us on Facebook. The URL for both the YouTube channel and the Facebook page will follow very shortly. Apart from that, thank you for watching and uh, please join me again for my next video. Thank you.